It is now time for Mind Meld with Montana. Viewers out there, send in questions for Colonel Bull Montana to answer. We have two visual questions and one in live studio question. Colonel Bull Montana, are you ready for the first question? Yes, I am. Hey, Bull, this is the snack shack. What do you like better, pancakes or waffles? All right, Colonel, the question was, do you like pancakes or waffles best? I like it. I like I like like uh, pancakes. And why is that? Why do you like pancakes more than waffles? Because so, I like the way the way that the pancakes are nice and round, and the waffles are square. So you like them because they're round yeah. more than because they're square. Yeah. Now, did you have a problem putting stuff into like in blocks, you know, shapes in different uh, holes as a kid? Correct. You did have a problem yeah. doing that. Yeah. So what do you put on the pancake? Well, I put on butter at night. I use uh, syrup. You put what kind of syrup? I use uh, maple syrup. What, just any old brand of maple syrup, huh? Yeah. So, so well, there you go, Snack Shark. That's from the world famous Snack Shark. He enjoys pancakes more than he likes waffles. We have another question, and this one comes to us from our old executive producer, none other than Sabrina Champagne Kane. Hello, this is Sabrina Champagne Kane, and I am coming to you from my vehicle. I am off to do an event in LA, and I am so sorry I couldn't be there to ask Bull this question live. But Bull, I was wondering, what is the nicest thing that you've ever done for a woman? Come on, have you razzled them, dazzled them, wined them, dined them? I want to hear about Bull's most romantic act. Love you. Mwah. All right, Colonel. Sabrina wants to know what's the most romantic thing you've done for one of your leading ladies? I, uh, I take, I go and I go and ask a nice, beautiful lady for a date. Yeah. And I take them dancing and I give them flowers. You take them dancing, huh? Yes. What kind? What do you do? Like the cha-cha, the waltz, whatever? What do you no, do? I do the twist. I do the, you do the twist? The, the twist, the monkey. Uh, the monkey? Well, what, what exactly is the monkey? I know you punched a clown, but what's the monkey? Uh, I'm down. My, my, you look like you're plunging a toilet or milking no, a cow. No, that was the monkey. That's the monkey? Yeah. Okay. Well, show us the cow if that's the monkey. Okay, they're both, both the same. Kind of reminds me of that R2-D2 uh, imitation you did about 25 yeah, years yeah. ago. So that's what you do. You take them out dancing. That's how you schmooze them, huh? Yes. What about the leading lady you're living with now? Is that how you schmoozed her? Um, she's, a, she's a nice lady. lady. She's a nice la lady, so I met her. I know you met her. Obviously, you yeah, met her. Yeah. I mean, but did you go like this? Is this how you got her? In, no. Into the bedroom and whatnot? No. All right, you going that? Okay, all right. <laughs> Okay, I hope that answers your question out there, Sabrina. We have a live... You know... Whoa, sorry. And then the other dance, uh, you know, I went and did the old chubby checker dance. Oh, really? Yeah. You did the chubby checker dance? Yes. Did you have a chubby when you danced? No, the, the twist. Oh, you twist? Oh, the back to the twist. Peppermint twist. The peppermint twist? Yeah. That has nothing to do with peppermint patty, and does it? The, the gentleman that, that wrote the song for there is... Joey D in the style letters. Oh, oh, you know, there's a bit of information that I needed before I went to bed tonight, knowing who invented the song, the Chubby Checker Twist over there, right? Yeah. Okay, are you ready for your third and final question in yeah. studio? Let's bring her out right now, our floor director, Olivia! My question for you, Bull, is what is your favorite TC moment? What's the well, favorite TC moment here, Colonel? Well, the favorite uh, classic moment of the TV TC show was, was my birthday. Oh, always thinking with your stomach, Colonel, because we had that big cake yeah. and it was presents for you. Yeah. That was the biggest, not the time when Pat Morita rubbed your gut or any of that no, stuff. Um, and then I loved the, the, great, uh, the great two guests that, uh, that we lost, Mr. Miyagi and uh, Mr. Morita. Uh huh. Yes. Boy, that's, that's, that's some fascinating yeah. memories there. You have another question, because that one, that one kind of, he answered it kind of, it sucked. Okay, ask him another one. Okay, my other question for you would be, if you had to choose one last meal oh, God. before you died, what would it be? Well, it, it's got to be a place, I believe it's in uh, Rhode Island. Uh, I whoa, whoa. believe it's called the, the Lobster Pond or something like the that. The Lobster Pond? Lost, lobster. Lobster. Yeah. Yeah, right. You're talking about the Nordic Lodge yeah, right. in the woods yeah. in Rhode Island. You got yeah. lobster palm from Nordic I Lodge. Mean, uh, you want, well, what do you want, Parmesan cheese I on mean, the lobster? The lot, 
The lobster pound. Oh, the lobster, lobster pound. Yeah, okay. That, yeah. Even though I just said it was called the uh, Nordic Lodge. Yeah. So you want, now, now lobsters, do you like them cracked with butter? I mean, how do you like them? I, I get the, even cracked, it doesn't matter. Cracked. Yeah. Now, do you crack them yourself or you have the other people do it for you? No, I, I can crack them myself. You can crack them yourself. Yeah. Do you like that monkey dance you were doing earlier? No, you get the, you get the little nutcrackers. A little nutcracker. Yeah. Isn't that a ballet? No, they got a nutcracker and you, and you, and you squeeze them. Oh, Paul, you get a little x-rated down here by your lobster mm -hmm. thing down here. We got a lady sitting next to you. No, you they, they know it's a nutcracker, nutcracker from Thanksgiving. You crack the nut. Oh, a nutcracker from Thanksgiving. Yes. What are you using a nutcracker for? You cracking open a turkey? They crack, they crack the lobster. Well, lobsters open. Okay, I understand that. But why, why is a nutcracker at Thanksgiving? What are you doing to pilgrims? TC, I mean, they use a nutcracker to crack the, the shells on the on the I understand that, but how did how did Thanksgiving get part of the equation? Olivia, how did they? How do you, how do you think? Do you have lobsters at your Thanksgiving? Yeah, because I, I would like to be invited. Yeah, if you're that's not inviting the case. us at anything. You're having lobsters at Thanksgiving. No, I don't. We're sucking I have, turkey. I have turkey, and then I have apple pie. Uh, you pies. You don't need a nutcracker for the apple pie. You eat, eat, eat nuts and all that oh. on the side. Oh, okay, like walnuts and stuff. Yes. Huh? Okay, why didn't you just say that? I mean, not walnuts. Okay, uh, unbelievable. Yeah. Okay, uh, viewers out there, if you have a question you'd like Colonel Montana to answer, nutcrackers or not, follow the information that's on the screen right now. Do you have anything to say your fans haven't seen you in a while? Well, I, I, well, I was overweight, but I'm not overweight anymore. You're looking fantastic, yeah. Colonel. I will give you credit there. Uh, what's the secret? My secret is I, I got a secret love finally. You got a secret love finally, huh? Yeah. She not cracking you? No. Oh, okay. Well, that explains it all. All right. <laughs> That's mind meld with Montana. Are you sure your bionic helmet isn't on too tight? I'm sure. <laughs>